Yes, and Barry Squibb is on the outside of the front row of the grid. Martin Skanker is on the second row, but it's Kenneth Hansen who comes away from pole to lead this one as Skanker comes up on the inside of Squibb uh, with Jean-Luc Payer already up into fourth place and Will Gollum Mountain, another very, very slow start. Young Skogstad is the white escort in there as well, but it is Kenneth Hansen leading it. Kenneth Hansen leads, and who is in third place? It is Barry Squibb, yes it is. Then comes Jean-Luc Payer and uh, Will Gollum is down in six and would gain a very slow start for Will Gollum in sixth position and already two cars are getting the right clear here as the new colour scheme shown very quickly there on the Barry Squibb car yeah, and I think Barry Squibb is dropping back a bit and we saw a quick glimpse there of Barry Squibb's car which began to look as though it's handling problem and could have a, a puncture maybe so poor old Barry Squibb is not going to take that first ever victory but uh, nevertheless Barry Squibb has turned in another fine drive here Will Gollop I think is perhaps a bit of a disappointment in this race we would have expected to have seen Will here at Brands Hatch right up on the pace but it's not to be no, we'll write down the order there as Barry Squibb is now being challenged by Jean-Luc and Jean-Luc goes through into third place, I think. Jean-Luc Maga surely up into third place. Martin Skanker still can't do anything about Kenneth Hansen. There is a battle between Jean-Luc and, yes, Jean-Luc up there now ahead of Barry Squibb. But this is what Rallycross is all about. It's nose to tail and no infringements at all. Very fair and technically perfect driving. It is indeed. And look at this. Will Gollop is up now ahead of Skogstad and challenging Barry Squibb. Yes, he goes through past Barry Squibb. He's up now behind Jean-Luc Pallier. He's in fourth place. And Skogstad is also squaring Barry Squibb. And I think Barry Squibb has indeed got a problem with that car. I can't really honestly see it from this angle as Skogstad lets his feelings now that he is through. And Skogstad goes up to fifth position now. Kenneth Hansen still goes through. And Kenneth Hansen wins it.